Hi friends and welcome. Today we're going to be making a printable sheet of tags. If you missed last week's video on how to create this tag, I will post it for you at the end of this video. Now that you've created your design, we want to be able to apply several of them on a page and be able to print them out. So we're going to go back to the dashboard by hitting the home button up in the upper left hand corner. This is going to take us back to our dashboard so that we can come up on the upper right hand corner and create a design. Come down to a custom size. We're going to choose a standard sheet of printer paper, which is an eight and a half by 11 or an 11 by eight and a half. I'm going to choose the portrait orientation of eight and a half by 11. Hopefully we can fit those tags on here. All right, now let's put our design onto the page by coming over in the far left hand corner to uploads. You're gonna upload your media by clicking on the purple button. This is gonna pull it right out of either your phone or your PC. We saved it under bird tag number two. And you just click on the image to place it onto the page. Now, the next thing that we're going to want to do take these lines and we're going to want to crop these as close to the image as we can because this is going to allow us size or tag a little bit better. Now the measurements are showing them to us in inches because we created our design in inches. So let's go with this a 1.6 by 2.6. I want to try to get four rows. So four rows times 2.6 would be roughly 10, 10.4 I think. So 10 and a half. So we're good. We just don't want it longer than 11 inches. So now you want to duplicate your image because you want to do a complete row across. Come up to the upper right hand corner and right next to the trash icon is the duplicate icon. So you're going to want to make sure that your design that you want to duplicate is highlighted. And now we're going to do it three times because and you'll notice your bars are lined up. I don't know if you guys can see the top bar. So this tells us that the first three are lined up to each other, but this last one isn't, but I actually want to move these over. All right, and that's showing us, the lines are showing us that they are all the same distance apart. Now let's see if they are lined up. All right, see the dots on the bottom? So that's showing us that they're all lined up on the bottom. We already know they're the same size because we duplicated them and they are the same distance apart. Don't stress too much if they're not. The next feature that we're going to learn how to use is the group feature. You're going to take your cursor up in the upper left hand corner of the page and do you see how we're creating like a box and then we're encompassing each design. And when you do that, this word group will pop up. We want to group them together because now we want to do a few rows here of the same grouping. So we're going to come back and visit the duplicate button. We're going to hit that three times. All right, so we just got to push these up. All right, let's see. Probably going to use that nudge button or the arrows. All right, awesome. So that doesn't look too bad. So we're going to go with this. We're going to come up and we're going to write bird tag printables. All right, so for this project, I want to be able to get the best quality for printing. I'm going to save this as a PDF print. We're going to hit PDF print. We're going to download it and let's print it out. One last thing that I wanted to remind you guys and show you. So make sure that your destination over here when you're going to print is going to the printer that you want to print out on. Make sure if you want it in color that you have it in color versus black and white because I've made that mistake before. And then come down, make sure that it says letter size, what is the standard sheet of paper. And usually it will ask if you want it in portrait or landscape orientation, but this didn't, it did put it properly. So that's just something to always check as well. 
All right, so let's check out our print. All right, and there you have it. If you found value in this content, please be sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more. Have a super blessed week and I'll see you in a few days.